one last change that I want to make here is to make this all of this data that we have to be assisted locally on the browser. So you don't lose the data when you refresh the browser as we did while we were testing this, okay? So in order to do that, since all of our state is basically in the NGRX signal store, we have a very nice automatic way to do that. And that is by using the one of the extensions in the NGRX toolkit, which is brought to us by the Angular Architects team. We need the with storage sync feature. And one of the features of the NGRX signal store is that it can be extended really easily by using custom features that you can do. Now, I'm not going to go in how to actually create custom features in a lot of depth, but we can just apply different extensions that other people have created as well, okay? So we can use the with storage sync. In order to do that, we need to install this NGRN Architects Toolkit by doing npm install Angular Architects NGRX Toolkit here like this. And now we can use this. We can import this from here. So we can go in our this and we can import it in from our NGRX Toolkit here and we can import the with storage sync here like this and then all we have to do is we have to provide this here with a specific key and it's going to automatically save all of our state whenever it is changed we can do with storage sync something like this and then within that we can give options to this so one of the options is key we can use the key as modern store for example and then it also has some other options so we don't want to persist all of the things so we don't want to persist loading here or you know category here and the products the whole products data because there are too many we only want to do wish list because that is what is said by the user the cart and the user itself the login state all right so we are going to do just these three things and we do that by using the select option here and select we can actually select the properties that we actually want to save so we're going to say wishlist items and cart items and we also want to do the user okay and go in our app here and you add to wishlist some of the items and you try to refresh it you're going to see that it remembers the wishlist items because it is storing it in our local store and you can actually now add all of these to cart you can save these things you can proceed to checkout you can log in so that state is also going to get saved. So everything remains synced and with just one line of code. And this is the beauty. This is the power of the NGRX signal store. And one of the benefits of keeping everything in your store here.